Hi, this is your reality test of International English Language Testing System powered by IGP to assess the level of the candidate. My name is Roman Bikwa and I am here to conduct the speaking of candidate number 1512 name. So, shall we start? May I know your full name? My full name is Archdeep Singh Thiru. Okay. How may I address you? Uh, my friends prefer to call me Avi and you may also call me Avi. Okay. Where are you from? Uh, I, okay, I am from a countryside area which is located near Khanna town and the district is Pail village Jargi. Okay. What is your previous qualification? Uh, recently I completed my standard, standard school of education and uh, now I am doing some household work so as I belong to the farmer's family. Okay. Let's talk about farming. Have you ever indulged in farming? Yes, I, as I said, I belong to the farmer's family. Then I have a lot of work like taking water of the crops and maintaining the discipline that the work is regulated in a proper way. And also I have also responsibilities of cows like feeding the time of cows and watering the time. What kind of farm would you like to visit? Uh, mainly I prefer to visit cow farms because from my childhood uh, I, I like to visit that farm because uh, I also have a lot of knowledge about cows that how to maintain them, which type of temperature and weather uh, they most like. Is farming an important occupation in your country? Yes, uh, in my country farming is a main reason uh, to increase in the GDP from past several years. Uh, as we also can see the graph and survey which detected that uh, farming plays an important role in every stage and also it is very important for the feeding of the uh, countryside areas uh, and also it is a uh, good uh, and uh, production management uh, for the cities. Do people engage in farming in your home ground? Yes, a lot, uh, every person in my hometown engaged families because in, uh, in, in India, the countryside area, uh, uh, the most of the countryside area engaged in the farming because they, it uh, comes from Asians uh, that they have belonged to the farming uh, family, that they do not have any other business to do, but some people prefer to do other business as they are much interested. Okay, let's talk about trust. Who do you trust most? Uh, the person I trust the most uh, is my brother uh, Amin because uh, from my childhood I share a lot of things with him and, I, and they even do not shout at me, they taught me how to do a good manner and how to be a person who is always help others and I trusted him the, him most, the most and the foremost reason is that uh, they do not uh, share my anything to, with my parents, uh, they just uh, take the, that thing in the room. Okay, what kind of people do you trust? And the, but mainly the, I prefer to, to trust the people who is in, who always are in a serious mood because sometimes uh, and also uh, study can conduct that the persons who have a happy mood uh, can uh, uh, give their uh, can give their teachings uh, to others so the people they do not able to trust. Have you ever lost trust in somebody? Yes, I have lost trust in somebody, every individual in their life lost trust at one time. And I lost from my 10th class of 10th paper, she, the person he taught me that the, this chapter is not good for the exams and there is not a lot of weightage. But the, most of the paper come from that chapter. Okay, do you trust artificial intelligence? Uh, no, I do not uh, trust artificial intelligence because sometimes uh, they give uh, wrong information and uh, some people can take it uh, seriously and they do not do their future activities uh, on the basis of that information. Okay, this is the end of part one. Now, for part two, here is a part with some question. You will have a minute to look at the question and you need to speak for two minutes on the topic of a card. If you wish, you can use this note and pad and pencil to make some notes.
individual have their own plans for the future. Some people plan for their career options, some people plan for the what they have to do in future to become a successful person and how to maintain our life naturally stable. But the, the plan which I made for the future which should be is going on a trip with my friends after the completion of standard school of education. Because we we did did this plan because we want to relieve from stress of education and we want to relax our mind from that regular routines which we followed for the purpose of studies. As if every person if they follow a regular routine on the same basis, they should be bored and not and feel irritated. They do not able to do any work with any interested and without any concentration and. I achieve it uh, with the proper planning. We do a lot of planning that what should uh, be bear with us, uh, what we should bring, and what uh, is the what is the way of driving, uh, like uh, which transport we should have to choose for the driving, which is more suitable for us. Uh, as uh, I prefer to choose car because we have a four friend of group, uh, and we will stay in the car with uh, and we will talk a lot of things with each other. Uh, if we use a uh, public transport, uh, there is a lot of privacy as much as compared to the uh, private transport. There is a lot of noises. In the car we have a lot of things we have to share. We also can share our past memories. And the plan which we can do on the occasion, the area is the hill station area which is very decorative and very stress free which is also an environmental place. We are able to take a lot, took a lot of pictures so we can remember our trip and even in the past or future we can uh, feel sad and we have memories re-again, re then we can see that pictures and videos to recognize our memories that how should we like to do our activities with the friends. Uh, I want this plan, we want this plan because they, I want to do this because we also have, a, because after the, after, because in the adult stage. Okay, I am going to stop you here. Your time is up, so please pass back the question Yes, thank you. Now, I will ask you more follow-up questions for part 3. What is better, having a lot of plans or having no plans at all? No, having a lot of plans is a better option because in future we do not know what is the problem which is occurred in front of us is what is this. We have to maintain a plan like we have always remained financially stable. Even we can take an example that if we have any incident happen with us, our body do not feel well and good, then we have to take admit in the hospital. For that we have to plan to manage our finances so that we can able to take admitted in the, in the expensive hospital so we can get a good result from the treatment of the doctors. Okay, why do most people make plans before they go for travel? Planning is the very important. Uh, planning is a very important process for everything. Even it does not depend. It is a trip or any other thing. Uh, the planning for the trip is important because we do not know what to happen uh, in the on the trip or during the road. We can also say that there is also bad condition of weather. Like uh, rainy areas can occur uh, during the uh, during the road trip. Uh, we should have to wear and take waterproof jackets, which help us a lot. Uh, and also we have to bring some groceries to eat during the road, uh, which sometimes. Uh, Take some people feel anxiety due to hill station area. They should have to take medicines for further purposes, which they do not able to do bad habits by their body. Do you think planning helps us to be prepared for unseen troubles? Yes, planning is very helpful to prepare for uncertain troubles because it is also main purpose of this is also main purpose of planning. Like something is happen with my with my road trip that there is a car tire is punctured and we do and we do not have any spare tire. Then I should plan further that if I get any problem in during the trip, then I call with my friend and I also help them and he come in on the time with the proper equipment. And help me. What do you think people do when they face unpredictable issues? Uh, the people uh, do it just depend on the stability and concentration of the people. Some people able to control their problems on that particular time, but some people confused and do not able to control. But the people should have to calm their mind and stress free to uh, to uh, to inculcate that problem and get out from the rid of this. How do individuals feel when their plans do not work out? Pardon? How do individuals feel when their plans do not work out? Uh, in this uh, type uh, of things uh, that people feel very demotivated, they, they think that the thing I should plan do not uh, even uh, come in true. 
uh, I should not have to do plan for further move. Uh, they also demoted and do not uh, take interested in any other activities. They should uh, uh, giving uh, their uh, stress free and uh, irritate uh, motions to others. Uh, and they also do not like these type of things. Uh, because uh, planning, uh, every person do planning with the full concentration and they have a 100% surety that is planned work. Do you think being unsuccessful is a sign of poor future planning? Uh, no, unsuccessful person is not a sign of a pure future planning. Some people have a good plan for their future, but the conditions and environmental factors uh, can affect their planning. Like uh, we can take the example of business management. Business management is the uh, management where the person has planned according to the seasons, according to the weather. Like uh, the people uh, taking an example, uh, a businessman can uh, do that. I should increase the sales of the warm clothes, but uh, we can see that in, in the warm condition, uh, the weather is unconditionally changed and the summer season comes, uh, which affects his sales. That's why the planning is not the main purpose of an assessment.